Good morning, Bethlehem. Good to see you here in worship. As I look out here, I see some of you are at a different service today. Uh, you forgot to spring forward, didn't you? For those of you who are guests with us today, we are very happy to see you here as well. And if you are uh, a guest, just sit back, relax, and enjoy the service. We are honored that you chose to, uh, to be with us here today. Uh, I want to remind you, as we often do, about the Bethlehem app. You can sign in to uh, show your attendance here. You can make prayer requests. You can get information about anything going on at the church. So uh, make sure you check that out and use the app. Other things going on, um, Convalescent Home Worship is uh, this afternoon at 2 o'clock. If you haven't been there before, it's a great opportunity to go and uh, support uh, some folks that don't get out to uh, worship the way they would like to. Uh, Al Gonzalez is going to be giving the message. Mark Levang will be providing the music. It's going to be a great service. So uh, if you haven't been there before, please check that one out. I want to remind you again, in two weeks, it's Adventure is happening. Um, that's a great gift that we give to the community by bringing them on our campus, giving them lunch and uh, games and stuff for the kids. And we need a lot of help. Uh, we need volunteers. We need donations. Uh, anything you can do to help us put that on, including praying for the event. Uh, we would appreciate that. If you want to know specifically what we need, you can check in the uh, Connection Center. That's, uh, oh no, I know what I want to tell you about. My favorite thing, the prayer walk. We are doing that every Thursday morning at 9.30, uh, a chance to walk uh, our community and pray for the uh, people around us and that uh, God would use us to serve them. And so uh, if you uh, have the time and the interest in that, please come by the office Thursday at 9.30. And then last, uh, I think it's been a week since we've seen Tim up here, so he's due. Here he is. Good morning, Bethlehem. Uh, this will be uh, my last announcement where I add myself to Rick's. Well, that's probably not true. We already know that's, uh, that's not true. But it's the last one that you know of. Uh, so anyway, what I wanted to uh, do today was uh, give you two special announcements. One uh, is, a, is the announcement that we're not going to be having 150 uh, this month or the next month or the next month we're actually going to be uh, ending that that program uh, the 150 concerts that we were doing and uh, if uh, if you're like me and you you really enjoyed going to it um, no worries there's actually every week an awesome experience led by Robbie Robinson in Simi Valley called uh, Jam and Java uh, it is very similar it's not the same because I don't do the audio so it's probably better but uh, that being said um, while I'm gonna miss having our 150s here we're going to take that energy and we're going to put that into to something else, uh, and that's okay. Uh, this was a fun thing to have for a while. Uh, now it's time for the next thing, and I look forward to sharing some of that information with you as we go forward, and hopefully uh, we'll find ways to, uh, to do that together. Um, the next announcement is one of celebration, one of just absolute gratitude from my heart, uh, from the heart of Crossfire, all the parents and the kids, uh, all the people who were participants in that ministry. You guys just blessed us with so much love, and uh, we're so grateful to you for participating in our fundraiser, uh, for buying tickets, for buying items, for donating items, for getting donations, um, for serving, and for bringing guests, uh, to the extent that we raised over $9,000 uh, toward our, our goal of going to the National Youth Gathering in 2019. Um, that means we're doing very, very well toward our goal of being able to, to take the probably the largest group that we will have ever taken uh, to the gathering. Very excited about that, want to say thank you. Um, I, I cannot list out every name of every person that I need to say thank you to, so you, you know who you are, you know you're, you're in our heart, and we appreciate you. But there's one person that I have to say thank you to, and that is uh, Andrea Evans. Thank you so much. I know you don't want me to thank you right now, but deal with it. Uh, I am so grateful for you. We all are in this church and in that ministry at Crossfire. Uh, you are incredible. and. Uh, so don't go anywhere, because uh, we need you. Um, all that being said, God bless all of you today and, uh, and this week. We'll see you.